So in this question, it asks, if an enzyme follows michaelis menten kinetics, what is the Vmax in U moles divided by minute if velocity is 25 U moles per minute when substrate concentration is equal to Km? So basically, since it asks for the michaelis menten kinetics, you'd use the michaelis menten equation. So you would, and the equation is simply velocity is equal to Vmax multiplied by substrate concentration divided by Km plus substrate concentration. So based on this, we just fill out with any information we know, and the information we do know is velocity is equal to 25. It seems like we don't have any other information, but they do give us that substrate concentration is equal to Km. Well, how can that be useful to us, right? How is this useful to us? Well, since it's equal, we can put any number, right? So for example, if Km is equal to substrate concentration, we can put that Km is 1, and that means substrate concentration would be 1. So Km would be 1 here, and substrate concentration would be 1 here, and this one would also be 1. Now let's solve this out. So 1 plus 1 is 2, so 2, right? So we'd multiply each side by 2. This would cancel out. Uh, 2 times 25 would be 50, and that would equal Vmax. So you might be wondering, what happens if I chose a different number? Well, you'd no matter what number you put for Km and substrate, since they're equal to each other, you'll always get the same answer. For example, if I said Km is 2, and that would mean substrate concentration would be 2. So if you filled out 2 for each of these, it'd be 2 plus 2 is 4. So 4, um, it'd be divided by 4, right? So you'd multiply 4 on each side, and you get 100, right? But then you'd have Vmax multiplied by 4, or 2 right here. So 100 divided by 2 would still be 50. So no matter what, um, no matter what you number you use here, um, you'll always get 50 as the answer because you're you're doing the same math. So you can try it for yourself and see that no matter what number you use, you'll always get 50. So the answer will be Vmax is 50 U moles per minute. And don't forget the units because if it's free response, they can take off points for that. So I hope that helped and thanks for watching.